When you get in the tunnel, you kind of get zoned out just thinking about the games and things like that, but it's definitely a once-in-a-lifetime experience. For Ohio State, you know, you're just trying to prepare as much as you can, um, just getting as much film in as you can, and just uh, doing everything you can just to prepare and make sure you know any situation that comes up. Hey, you know I need your eyes, right? I know I need your eyes. I can see everything in your eyes. Look at me, baby. Let me see it. I know we're ready to play. I know we're ready to play. It's not about them anymore. It's about us playing here. It's about us. We sacrifice to each other every play. You feel me? Every play. Yeah. Let's go, boys. Let's go. Stay in top three. One, two, three. Hey. Let's go. I know what you can do. I know what you can do. I know what you can do. Leave it here. Leave it here. I don't want nothing in the tank. Let's go. I'm just ready to get out there, ready to go play. You know, you've been working all summer, all spring and things like that, so just ready to get back on the field. Well, we just always say just, we're going to play confident, we're going to play fast, we're going to play hard. And that's what we did. We just go out there and just uh, play as hard as we can and just know that we can count on each other and play for each other. And uh, I always tell people we, you, can, you can talk about how much you care about each other, but you really show people how much you care about how hard you play. And uh, that's what we were talking about with everybody. You know, show me how much you care with every game, with how you play. Show me how much you care. We knew there was going to be a lot of momentum swings in that game and just trust that uh, that was their best punch right there and that we could fight right back. And fortunately, we did. And then uh, some things happened and ended up getting away from us. But that was probably the way we responded after being down 14 nothing. We just got to learn to finish. That wasn't, that wasn't the only game on our schedule. I know a lot of people hype that up as to be the biggest game ever here, but that's not the only game on our schedule. You know, we have a lot more, and we can't let Ohio State beat us twice, beat us three times, all that stuff. We can't let that linger. I mean, that's just what the game of football demands, you know. Every week, you just got to move on whether you win or lose. You know, you got another week to prepare for another team. What we try to do is just focus on things we can control, and we. And we can't control who gets hurt and all that stuff, so we got to focus on what we can control, and that's how we play, and that's doing our job. So no matter what, no matter who's behind center, we still got to do our job. We still got to uh, do our role as best we can, so we try not to let that affect us. You get that one day off, and then you're right back into practicing and just going hard. Um, forces you, I think it's kind of a good thing, it forces you to forget about it quick, because if you don't, then you're not going to play well. So it forces you to just move on right away, and I think that was actually good for us. I know for us, defensively, you know, we just know, like, what the coaches expect from us. And like I said, they challenge us defensively, whether it's our gap, gap schemes, our, our passing game scheme and things like that, that no matter who we play against, you know, we can give up big plays. But, you know, that's why we got to be consistent and we just got to be exact in everything that we do. We got to bring the stadiums back. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Just take yeah. that personally, man. We haven't been the same. You know what I'm saying? Take that first. Every time you touch this ball, we're making a play. We're making a play. You got me? Let's go. Stallions on three. One, two, three. Stallions. Being consistent like always and uh, you know just just being more being more of a leader and just like I said defensively our main goal is just being consistent and doing it day in and day out. It was just, just good to see your hard work pay off. You know, the hard work that we put in during the week, you know, even though it was a short week, just seeing how, how hard we were working. And you know, that's what you like to see. You like to see it pay off on Saturdays. First one, the first one's huge. Just getting that first one on your belt so you can start to get rolling. And I can't wait to continue this throughout the season and get another one this weekend, so.